In red blood cell fragmentation, the key abnormality you're going to be looking for would be a demonstration of measurement in regards to a non-biologic quantity. So looking at the normal distribution curve, you would find variations that are not dumbbell in shape. And because they are fragments, they are smaller than the normal red blood cells. So they will be to the left, the changes will be to the left of the curve. And you will see a tail that is flattening out as you go closer to the axis. That represents the fragments which are smaller than the RBCs. They are not programmed, they are non-biologic in quantity and therefore you will find a tail, not a dumbbell shape curve.